What's up everybody and welcome back to Timothy Hannock. Um this is this is gonna be just a basic video. Um I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm still working on my book. And I don't want to read it to you guys until I'm completely done with it. Uh, unfortunately for me, I did lose a subscriber. I don't know why. But um, it is what it is. It's not the first time I've lost subscribers. But, uh, you know, I just deal with stuff like that. It happens. Anyway, I got like 15 pages of this thing down. And I'm surprised that I'm remembering as much as I am. It's almost like I'm reliving it, but fast forward like times 20. It's weird. Um, anyway... When I get done, whenever that is, I'm trying to get it done as soon as I can. And I know, Christian, that you, you, you told me I, I, there's no hurry, stuff like that. But right now, I feel like I am kind of in a hurry because the way I'm looking at it, I got like pretty much a month probably. Um, I was looking at a message that popped up on my phone. Ah, oh, crap, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I got pretty much a month before I'm planning on going back to work. Um, things haven't been working out for me. I've got a hold of this lady who I was talking to on the phone with. And she she gave me an email with phone numbers to call for group supports, you know, groups that will pay for um, my rent and stuff. And all I've been doing lately is pretty much surviving on donations that people have been giving me. So if anyone over out, anyone watching this, feel bad and you want to donate like five or ten dollars, every little bit helps. Every little bit counts. I will put my GoFundMe page in that da uh, down below in the description. You don't have to um, give away anything. It's just totally up to you. I understand that money is not easy to come by and everything. <laughs> don't feel pressured or feel like you, you need to help me out. But, um, yeah, I got pretty much, I'm basically looking at somewhere around next month that I may end up getting this part removed unless, unless I can get, um, this $10,000 grant up to $10,000. It, it, it sounds like a lot of money, but to t tell you the truth, $10,000 or $5,000, all that stuff, it goes by quicker than you think. And honestly, I'll just use it to catch up with my rent, keep up with my bills, and then if I have enough money after bankruptcy and everything, buy myself a car, a, a decent used car, and just go from there, you know? It, it's going to take a long time to come back around in my life, so I just wanted to let you guys know. I wasn't planning on making a 15 minute video like I usually do, so that's that's everything that's going on with me. I just wanted to give you guys an update with everything. But yeah, as you see here, this, uh, I got like I said 15 to 20 pages done. I'm about halfway done with this, maybe maybe about 60 or 70 percent done, but you get the drift. I, I'm working on it. It's getting done. Uh, I really hope this book helps you guys out. I really hope that it helps a lot of people out. 
I'm not trying to compare my life to your guys's, so don't take this the wrong way. Honestly, please don't. I'm really just trying to help people. That's all I want to do. Because my eyes have been opened, and unfortunately, it is so hard to open your eyes when nothing terrible happens to you. If you don't go through a life threatening situation like me, like cancer or whatever, it's really hard to be convinced that any day you can die. You don't think about that. You just live your life. But if something terrible happens and a doctor flat out tell, tells you, I'm surprised you're not dead or you should have been dead, you know, something like that, then you start thinking, jeez. Uh, what would happen if I did die, you know? How many people would be upset? And, you know, you start thinking about things a lot more. And without actually going through a life-threatening situation, you're not really going to think about things. You don't care to think about it. I remember that feeling of not really caring what's going on out in the world. I mean, you do in the, and you don't at the same time, you know? But, um, yeah, when I get done with this, I will let you guys know as soon as it gets done, and I'll be excited. But I will warn you, there are a lot of things in here I was thinking about taking out, but then it would kind of ruin everything, sort of. Like, I, like I've mentioned before, there are things in here that will seem impossible, and you guys will probably think I'm crazy for for saying certain things in this book, but I, I promise you everything in here is 100% true. Just remember that. Alright, that's the end of this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you want to hear this story, if you want to be one of the first, you know, thousand people, whatever, to, to ever hear this crazy, um, sad story, whatever, um, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell so you can get all the notifications as soon as possible. And take care, everyone. I'm doing better, and my last chemo treatment's coming up fast. Wish me luck. Peace.